Okay, the third player in initiative order is Bizarro. Now, Bizarro hasn't got a card to allow him to play two expeditions. He can only do one expedition. He could either move uh, to Leon, who's down here, or Bizarro himself. Now, Bizarro's in a city. Now, I think this would be a good chance to get it. Well, no, actually, I've got food, so I don't need to to roll to get food. Um, you need food in the subsistence uh, part of the turn, which comes after all the impulses. Uh, it prevents you having to roll a dice for starvation. Now, I haven't got much gold, so I could do plunder or diplomacy for gold. Let's see. Now I've got a diplomacy oh, against the Imperial City, that diplomacy modifier. Oh, no, I haven't got any cards that would would actually aid a diplomacy roll. Um, I've got a choice, really. I can plunder. Which I don't think is a particularly bad thing because you're not going to get any civilizations here. I, I would say, um, I would actually plunder. Right, so I've got no cards that are going to help me here, but there are quite a few players who can hinder me. Um, Now certainly Amalgro, who's nearby, is going to play this reaction card for play, priest side the treasure. So it subtracts two from my plunder roll. There's not a great deal I can do about that. Uh, so I roll on my plunder gold table. 1d6. There's no benefits or negative effects on the dice. I'm rolling for a standard city so I get a four which minus two is two so that gives me eight gold. Okay and that's the end of Pizarro's impulse.